Hey, Diana, I wanted to congratulate you with the reviews that you have on this listing. I know how competitive this category can be. So to see the ratings that you have is really a job well done. Now, my job is to look for potential opportunities with sellers who prioritize on Amazon. And if it's okay with you, I'd like to show you a few opportunities I found with your listing, including a module on this listing that you haven't filled out yet. It's available to you. My name is Sean and I'm with my Amazon guys. So listen, I'm going to pack this full of valuable information. Let's dive right in. Now, coming over here, utilizing this tool to look at your keywords, I noticed they're pretty low. You've only got 207 sponsored and then 13. 1,556 organic keywords. So both of these are low. Uh, we do recommend a one to two ratio as well. So for every one sponsored, you have two organic. But, but let's take a peek. Let's look and see how your keywords are performing. So I'm going to get out of the way here and show you a few things. So I sorted by the most frequently used keywords in this category. And you see water bottle. Geez, almost a half a million people are looking for that. Um, I don't see that too often. So water bottles with times to drink. That's very common. Kids water bottle. Kids water bottle. Look at that. Okay. And look at where you're ranked. So it's high, very high. As a matter of fact, now that I scroll, I'm just seeing this now for the first time. All of your organics, except for I think maybe two, you're in triple digits. Your organics need, need a lot of help. And let me show you what I mean. So we've got kids water bottle here. 106,000 people are looking for that this month alone on Amazon, and you're organically ranked 258. Now, look, I know sponsored ads have gone up quite a lot in the past year, but they are a vital part of advertising on Amazon. And so you've got all the sponsored ads before yours, all the other 300 nearly organic ads before yours. So it's going to be really hard for you to get your share of the nearly $5 million that's going to be generated by the words kids water bottle on Amazon this month alone. Um, so going back 258 organically, that's several pages deep. It's going to be hard for people to find you and hard for you to get your share of that revenue. So that's what I mean. Your organics need improving. Now, I found this listing by taking the words plastic water bottles out of your title. And I'm not doing any product comparisons. What I want to show you is this. They're advertising and they've got the right ratio. They've got a two to one ratio um, for organic to sponsored. And look at their organics. They almost have 6,000 organic keywords. And because of that, um, even if they had, you know, maybe 300 sponsored or compared to you, only 200 sponsored or maybe even fewer because their organics are so high, they will sell more than you if you maintain your keywords the way they are. Now, coming back over to your listing. So speaking of maintaining the way they are, let me show you what we do in phase three of our three phase SEO process. So looking at those keywords where you're organically ranked in spots 20 through 50, right now you've got 40 of them. So our focus would be to integrate a lot of these keywords throughout your copy, grow your organics so that instead of being in spot 38 for water bottles in bulk, which is what you sell, uh, we would have you in the top 10. And this would drive much more traffic. And also it can help with your ACOS if you're not having to advertise there. So food for thought on that. Um, and you know what? Now that I'm here, I want to try something else. I don't typically do this, but I do want to show you uh, yeah, you don't have that many organic ranked single digits where there's traffic. I mean, only 200 people right here are looking for that 83 people. So uh, needs help. So listen, let's come over to your listing. I love that you got your six images and video. Fantastic on that. The images in the video are great. All that keywords, all that has to um, has to help though too to be able to lift your listing higher in the ranks. Um, your images are fine though. I don't know if I would make any changes other than one image with someone looking at the camera. This creates a connection with the consumers when they're looking at your listing. It's it, their psychology behind it, but definitely uh, do recommend that. Now your title short, this is where you can bump up your organic keywords. You've only got 77 characters and you can go to 200 characters in your title. And then as we scroll down about, ah, okay, this is why your, your organics are really low. You have very limited information here. You can put 250 characters in each bullet. So I absolutely recommend doing that. That's where Amazon looks to 
to get your organic keywords. Now let's talk about that module that you don't have filled out. So if you do anything today, please do this. Log into Seller Central and just above product description, you see a brand story or a brand stores. I believe it's a brand story. That's where you can put your brand logo, you know, the Rolling Sands icon. You can talk about, you know, what, how you got your start, why you do what you do, what makes you so unique and special, but it takes up a lot of real estate here on the listing. And since you don't have enhanced brand content, at least do this. You've got the store. So put your brand story on your listing. I do recommend that. I also recommend enhanced brand content with a product grid, but that's down the road. So, hey, here at my Amazon guy, we're a 225 person agency and we grow sales on Amazon. We manage over 200 brands, giving our clients peace of mind, knowing that Amazon is handled so they can focus on their business. But I'd love the opportunity to chat with you. So please click that link in my email that reads book a call snag yourself a free consultation. As soon as you do that, I'll email you that competitor analysis. But hey, thanks so much for watching. I look forward to speaking with you soon. Take care.